Several sides ablaze near the historic Croatian city of Dubrovnik, a fiery response from Bosnian Serbs to a Croat attack on one of their own positions. In the context of the former Yugoslavia, it was just another battle. As in the Black Sea resort town of Sochi, there was yet another bid to find a diplomatic solution. This time, US National Security Advisor Anthony Lake and Russia's Foreign Minister. Are you optimistic of finding common ground? I think, uh, of course I am, and I think uh, I will reserve any comment. Thank you. Lake's meeting with Kozirev followed a whistle-stop tour of European capitals in which he'd sought support for a new US peace initiative. And he got some. The two couldn't agree on Moscow's desire to lift sanctions against Serbia, but afterwards Kozirev did support the US proposal for an international summit. There is still a window of opportunity for political effort and conference on the highest level of political authority with participation of the parties themselves. As the talk continues, so does a search by Croatian troops for rebel Serbs thought still to be hiding in Kraina. And four years on, so does the conflict. <laughs> <laughs>